So we have now set up our first ads and we're waiting for Google to approve our ads. Meanwhile, there is something very important that we need to do so we don't waste money on useless clicks. For example, when somebody types in Oximeter Amazon, then that person who types that in will probably look for an Oximeter from Amazon. They probably wanna buy from Amazon or when they type in specific brands of what you're selling that are that isn't you, then you don't wanna show your ads to those people because they already know where they wanna buy from. They don't wanna buy from you, they wanna buy from Amazon or Walmart or something like that. So what we wanna do is we wanna set up a list of keywords that we want um, to apply to our campaigns so that whenever somebody types in one of those keywords, our ads will not show up and we won't waste money on those clicks. So what you have to do is go to tools on the top here and then click on negative keyword list under shared library. And as you can see here, I have a general list and I have in a specific list to my product. The general list is a list that I will always use no matter what, uh, what product I'm selling because these are stuff like, if you go in here, you see this is stuff like Amazon, cheap, China, contact, coupon, discount, drop shipping. All those keywords aren't really um, good. They, they, they're not converting to customers for me. So I'm putting them in a negative keyword list. If you wanna add keywords, just click on the plus sign here, add your keywords here. So you have to do a, let's say a plus, and then let's say Walmart, for example, because those people, they wanna buy from Walmart and not from you. So click on save, and then this keyword will be added right here in the negative keyword list. And um, then when you have set up your keyword list, you can go down and you can click on apply to campaigns and then choose your campaign right here. I already chose all of my campaigns. So make sure you choose your campaign, otherwise it won't be active. Make sure you choose it, click done, and then um, this will be active. Now I have these um, standard ones right here. You can go through them real quick. So you can see them, maybe copy them. All right, so these are the keywords. Of course, this is for a physical product store. If you have like a service business or something, you might wanna use other keywords. But another thing I wanna show you, because as, you, as you've seen, I have two lists. I have a general list and then Oh, sorry, I then I have a dedicated list for my specific product. So oximeter list. These are words that I learned by gathering data from my ads. So I noticed that people click on my ads, uh, people who click on my ads, they type in Bluetooth or ChoiceMed or CMS50F, which are brands that aren't me. So people who type in contact, for example, are looking for an oximeter from this brand. So I don't wanna show my ad here. So what I did was I went back here, went into my campaign, then I went to, um, sorry, then you go to keywords, search terms, and then you see what people are, um, what people are actually typing in, what gives you clicks. And as you can see here, oxygen level tester. Um, oximeter and then you find words like oximeter CVS oximeter reading chart we have Omron oximeter which is probably also a brand so I paid for a click right here and it's obvious that this probably won't convert into a sale for me so what I would do is I would copy this word right here copy and then I would go back into tools negative keyword list oximeter list and then I would click the plus sign and type in plus and then Omron, and then I'm just gonna click on save. And now um, this is added to my negative keyword list. So whenever somebody types in this word, my ads won't show up. So especially in the beginning, make sure to check out your search terms on the keywords right here and see what keywords you're showing up for and then, then keep building out your negative keyword list, which again will kind of um, it will avoid you paying for useless clicks, which will save you a lot of money.